Hey guys, Blue Yoshi, and welcome back to the Legend of Zelda Birth of the Wild. Last time, we explored the Kuro Peak and its surrounding hills, obtaining all the treasures that there was to find in that area. And today, we are continuing on to the Wetland Stable and hopefully making our way to the Zora's Domain. I'm here with my brother, Micah, today. <laughs> And he's going to be doing commentary with me as we go into the final episode here of Subweek. This is episode 36 of The Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild. So, yeah, as you can tell, guys, this will be a special long episode here for you guys of The Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild. Celebrating 100 subscribers here on my channel. Uh, so, I do plan on getting a, a lot more done in this episode than most. So, hopefully you guys are okay with that. Uh, I could have sworn that there was a clock in this area. There, there's a treasure chest right there. Should probably get that. Oh, uh, you got that guy as a side. Is that guy? It looks like. Yeah, that's guy. Okay. Well, yeah. Well, if it's just a quest, then it's a side quest. That's how. It's either a main quest, a shrine quest, or a side quest. So, like, unless this guy has a. Okay, anyways, I'm reading too far into this. What should I do? I'm terrified of deep water. Okay. Hmm. Oh, sorry. I was lost in thought. Lost in thought. I can't believe I'm about to share this with you, but I'm absolutely stumped. Have you seen that strange shape down at the bottom of... Oh, yes, yes, I have. It's, got, it's a chest. I can't believe I don't know how to fish out of the water. I guess it needs some kind of machine. So curious to see what's inside that chest, I can't even sleep. Well, so it is your lucky day. Because thanks to the power of Magnesis, I shall gi give myself my wivel bed reward. That's the name of the quest. Oh, the treasure chest. Incredible. I can't believe you managed to get that treasure chest out of there. Hurry up and open it already. Do just that. You don't have to tell me twice. Okay, I'm guessing. Oh. Oh, wow. Um. Night Spot Sword, weapon at 26, which is actually really, really strong at this point. Knights of Hyrule once carried the sword. These days, it's the weapon of choice for se seasoned adventurers, thanks to its ease of use and high attack power. I... <laughs> inventory. I'm gladly going to be taking that. Broadswords are like my favorite class. Yeah, I'm gladly going to be taking that right there. <laughs> I'm so happy, dude. Blood swords, my favorite. A and the strong one, too. L is question, is that the... No, it's not the strongest one that we have. Oh, and yeah, what was inside the church? It was a sword. What? So cool, a sword, you say? Whatever, I didn't even want that life-changing treasure anyway. It's not, it's not even really... It's not really life-changing, though, is it? It's like a sword. So unless it's saving your life, I mean... Otherwise, I mean, if you save your life with a sword, that technically is life-changing, correct? I don't know. <laughs> Anyways, well, at least I can relax now that I know what was inside. Thank you. Alright, well, that will be the level bed reward. Uh, Alright, so I did want to kind of explore the wetland stable here, but here's the thing. In between episodes, um, I kind of uh, explored this area, and there's literally nothing to do here. There's a single quest, and I already took it on, so yeah, <laughs> but... Um, so yeah, there's really nothing to do here at the wetlands table, nothing to see, and just gonna go directly to the shrine for you guys' sake, because there's really nothing to see there, so. Uh, and plus, I want to get as much done in this episode as possible, so spending time at a stable, it's not a very good use of our time, I don't think, anyway. <laughs> but, <laughs> um, alright, horse gates. By the way, I just remembered, um... This is the first episode uploaded since Xenoblade Chronicles 2 has, uh, I think, come out? I think that's... I think it's been released. Yeah, yeah. Xenoblade Chronicles 2 just came out. And I am really excited for that because if you guys uh, don't know, uh, Xenoblade Chronicles is one of my favorite games. It's either my second or third favorite game. Uh, basically... Yeah, so it's like... Yeah, and, and the fact that uh, it just came out, I'm super excited. The reason why I'm specifically noting this in a Breath of the Wild video is because I got a, a side quest notification about it at the start. Uh, but anyways, that is a shrine over there. Not a sh <laughs> what am I talking about? No, that's a guardian, not a shrine. That's a shrine over there. <laughs> he says whilst inside a shrine. 
Something's wrong about this picture, everyone. Um, hmm. I want to get that chest right there. Again, I do have a broken game bed, so sometimes it just decides not to work. So, uh, da, 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 da. I don't want to be under the ice cube, or else it's gonna. Not the ice cube, the cryonis cube, I suppose. <laughs> the cryonis cube. That works. Cryonis. Okay, we we made that without even batting an eye. What am I talking about? Uh, there's some more guardians over there. Hello. You wanna be my friends? Oh, too bad, because you're oh, Nope, I missed that guy. Uh, he's not gonna even attack me. He hasn't even noticed me. What the heck? I've shot three arrows at him, and he still hasn't noticed me. This guy is, like, top-notch. <laughs> Some high-quality technology you Sheikah got right here. This is pretty advanced stuff. <laughs> that's, not, that's not good. Uh, <laughs> um, if I could just get to that. Wait, wait. Okay, okay, there we go. Can stop my momentum right there. Get onto the left. Oh god, oh god, ba, ba, ba. okay. I was hoping I could get onto that one, though. Uh, I was hoping I could get onto that uh, small uh, platform right there. Like right there. You know, like right there, right? Well, technically, it's the one on that side. I could maybe save myself, but I missed the jump and I will shoot. <laughs> um, I made the same mistake again, everyone. <laughs> Uh, okay. Pick it on this way too. Now I should be able to make this jump idea. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. Okay. Wanna get on t No, 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 you don't. No, 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 no. Okay, alright. Well, I'm just gonna accept my death at this point, because that <laughs> there's nothing else to do right here. That was um nothing. <laughs> I'm sorry. Um hmm. <laughs> alright. Oh <laughs> man, I'm like stopping the laugh. Okay, I need to be a little more careful this time. Okay. Up, 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 up. Okay, there we go. Doing just fine for ourselves. I lift up this gate right here. I believe there was a chest if my memory serves me right. There we go. A uh, quick open the chest, see what it has in store for us today. Night Spot Sword. Another one. Um, I'm gladly going to be taking that. <laughs> um, <laughs> okay. I, I mean, I mean, okay, okay, game. If, if you want to be that nice to me on final episode of Subweek, I am gladly going to be taking that. Can't break that. There we go, okay. I'm going to I think then you can just leave the shine. Yeah, let me know. I need to make this shine. Yeah, just leave the shine right here. Talk to this guy right here. Um, yeah, let's collect our, I believe this is our fifth spirit orb. Wait, I'm not sure how many we had in total. Uh, but, alright, well, let's quick collect our spirit orb. A symbol of courage given to those who have overcome the trials of a shrine. For here, right there, may the goddess smile upon you. Alright, well, let's, let's get right back into this. I do mean to get a lot done in this video. So hopefully, again, I said at the start of this video, I do want to make it to the Zor's Domain. I'm not sure if that's realistic or not, but it's a goal of mine. So, um, yeah, the, I, there was a second shrine. It was right next to the Zor's Domain. I think I highlighted it in purple. Yeah, purple right there. Uh, so that's going to be our next uh, point of interest right here. Wait, is it just Tony Knight? We might have some skeleton... Uh, Star Moblins, that's what they're called. I want to say Skeleton Bacoblins, but technically they're called Star Moblins, or Star Bacoblins, or whatever the- Are they called Star Moblins or Star Bacoblins? I forget. Alright, oh wait, Hawk, oh, we go! Oh, there's a camp- Oh yeah, that's right, I was gonna say, that's a campfire right there, what's going on over there? But then I realized, oh yeah, that's right, I already explored that area. <laughs> uh, oh, um... What are you, what are you doing? Uh, yeah, this, that looks like a Yiga clan guy. Oh, yeah, that's a Yiga clan guy. Oh, okay, oh, let's fight me. Fight me, you fiend. Ah, oh, nice sickle you got right there. It'd be a shame if someone were to take it. Okay. Okay, well, it didn't give me a chance to respond. Joke. 
Ah, uh, restless cricket, restless cricket. <laughs> when, when you're in a fight and you just take a second to take a bug off the ground for your collection. Wow, I just slashed that guy three times and he died. Mighty bananas. <laughs> yes. Uh, vicious tickle. That's like 16, right? So technically that's better than this. But I think I'm going to keep it because it's blue and I like blue. <laughs> And because it's a uh, spear, and I like those ten. I like those a little better than. Yeah. Uh, is that? Yeah, that's a wizard, but uh, I'm not gonna be fighting that guy because that's just a waste of time. We really don't need. I've realized now that our fire and like electric or whatever they're called, like lightning. Yeah, fire, li fire, lightning, and ice rods weren't really too good, <laughs> and that we really don't use them too much. Because they're kind of inaccurate and they just keep on going. It's hard to utilize its uh, special power like effectively. So uh, speaking of that, there's another guy over here uh, by the J Japonja or Japonga village rooms. Uh, who makes a village right here in the middle of a uh, like wetland? Anyways, that village was asking to be destroyed. To be honest. <laughs> uh, Here's a question. Is the high nox? No, that's a tree. <laughs> I was gonna say, is that a high? No, that's a tree. Um, yeah, but yeah, is the high nox still here? Cause the blood moon, you know, came. Does he just respawn? Does he respawn? Does he? I don't see him. Oh, hello there. <laughs> okay, I'm not gonna be uh, going over there. <laughs> Um, uh, ba, 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 okay, well, I'm just messing around with Choco at this point. I'm sorry, everyone. Yeah. Um, yeah, we're just gonna go over here. There might be a hard part to navigate with Choco or right two. Oh, what, what is that right there? It's like a house. There's a fucking house over there. Okay. We're gonna have to look to see what that is later. Anyway, so we're gonna be some enemies in this vicinity, and we're on Choco on a very uh, small path. This is basically asking for disaster right here. Uh, headshot. There we go. Oh, wow, I actually like fully predicted when you would get that too. That was great. Okay. Octoar can't aim for caterpillar poop. And just as I say that, he hits me. There we go. Yeah, I, I was trying to, but it didn't, didn't work out too well. Alright. Uh, I think that's it. I don't remember any enemies in this area. No. Um. All right. I think. Well, I, I, no, I did not mean to take a left. Did not mean to take a. <laughs> you see the way that Choco's walking right there? That was amazing. That was amazing. Uh, 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 um, um, Choco, Choco, buddy. Um. It seems Choco is stuck. Um. All right, <laughs> not sure what that was. Um, yeah, can't go, can't go that fast. Um, well, we are having a little bit of trouble here. Um, okay, that's that. We're good. We're good, guys. We're good. Okay. I wanted to see what was over there, but yeah, it was like a, it's a house or something. It's pretty interesting. All right. So according to the map, the best way to do this would be. To yeah, take a right right here. I think we can just climb up the slope right here to make it. I think so. There's a person right here. This looks suspicious. Duma. I think that's how you pronounce her name. Duma. I'm gonna be a fun little horse, Duma. Hey, it's kind of weird to see a Hylian around here. Indeed. <laughs> <laughs> hey, me. I'm a peddler, so I'm free to go where the wind takes me, or the waves, or whatever. Yeah! <laughs> what even is that? Yeah! <laughs> oh, let me introduce myself. I'm Duma. Nice to meet you. In any case, I just wanted to ask you something. You just spoke to that Zora over there, yeah? And that Zora told you to head over to Zora's domain to meet Prince Sidon, that right? Um, this struck me as suspicious. Yeah, I met that so-called Prince Sidon. Thing is, he said he ain't no good. Alright, oh no. Well, what am I to do? First thing he says to me, he says, I've been watching you. Ooh, spooky. And then he says, what's your name? Can you believe that heat? Can you believe that heat? Is that just, like, slang that I don't get? 
<laughs> so I ran away from him and all that noise, and now here I am. So, yeah. Uh, huh. Alright. <laughs> uh, well, that was an um, experience. What the heck? Was that an Octolog? Something shot at me. Oh, that. Oh, oh, hello there. Hello there. Let, stay still so I can shoot you in the head. There we go. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. Quick slice you real quick. Slice you and dice ya. Uh, there we go. Uh, hey, hey, that's not. That's not. Fi oh, oh, salamander. Salamander. Uh, bah, nope. He just threw a throwing spear. He did something right. Gosh darn it, man. Okay, where is the shrine? I thought it was around you. Oh no, it's up ahead. It's up ahead. Okay, something going on right here. Oh, it's raining. No, okay. Let's go. <laughs> yeah, that's kind of weird. Throwing spear, not really worth our time. Oh, dude, I actually got a headshot from you. Okay. These guys run too fast for my uh, preference. Alright, jump attack! Nope. Oh! What the heck? That killed? Alright, alright, alright. Let's see what that was. <laughs> I am um, kind of worried all of a sudden. <laughs> uh, we were like over 3 HP though. How much damage does that do? Ah oh, man, now we're back here. Gosh darn it, everyone. Alright everyone, I'm back. Got through that. That was harder than you guys would have thought. But anyways, we're going to be taking a left right here. Uh, I don't want to be dealing with that. Did I just run over a wild boy right there? I think I just did. I think I just did. Okay, I, it should be right up ahead right here. Right? Yeah, up right there. So coffee. So coffee, you. So coffee. Please describe this coffee. So. It's not an adjective that doesn't work, I'm sorry. <laughs> English 100. Alright, got into this idea of cutting grass. Did you know that you can cut grass in a Zelda game? <laughs> really? <laughs> if only the- If only that was like a main staple trope in the game. Okay, we are having a minor test of strength coming out over here. I think we're good. Yeah, not a modest test of strength. The last one was harder. But were we harder with him? Yeah. Okay. How is this model going to vary? Okay, so he doesn't- So this guy doesn't have the giant, like, battle axe. <laughs> yeah, he has the guardian sword, but no battle axe. There we go, that's what I'm talking about. Let's quick get that parry. Okay. Man, this bot sword isn't doing as much as I put it like. Okay, now he's going for that spin move. Uh, is he going to hit the first or second pillar? He got first pillar right here. Okay, go to get a quick swipe and swipe and three others. Uh, oh wow, he's already going for that move. All right, we are seeing a spinny move on the ground. Uh, here we go. There we go. All right, that's some good damage on him right there. Should be able to take him out. No, yeah, he, he has three HP. Of course he does. Um, does he shoot things? I want to know. Oh yes, he does. Yes, he does. Yes, he does. I'm just gonna shoot you, I teal. <laughs> I forgot how long the startup was for that move. Um, all right, well that was. I can't say that's easier than I thought it was gonna be, but um. All right, guardian shield. Yep, that's pretty good. Guardian sword. Gonna definitely be taking that over. I saw it. That's kind of unuseful. We aren't really gonna be fighting too many fire guys coming up in this next water area. I don't imagine. <laughs> Um, question is though, is that going to be a weapon or is that going to be a, like, in, like a ancient thing? Oh no, it's a bow. Alright then. <laughs> Just subvert my expectation entirely. Just, <gasps> is it going to be a weapon or is it going to be an ancient something? Oh no, it's a bow. Alright, alright. Uh, I mean, I'm not against this. 26. <laughs> um, alright then. Alright. Alright then. <laughs> Collect our second spirit orb. I am not against sign the slightest, everyone. Alright, that will be 
Knight Bow and Knight Bloodsword in one single episode, mind you. That was that was really good. I'm glad I took this due to you, right here, even though it was several episodes long. We definitely got a lot better in between those episodes. If you think about it, I mean, we defeated a Guardian, first of all. We've gotten so many strong things that, you, that I wouldn't have gotten anyway. I mean, like, almost everything that we have, we got through this journey. Like, the, through this little, um, I don't even call that detour that we took, you know? Like, the, if we look at our weapons, I mean, like, all this rods, like, we took all the rods from our detour. I don't remember what the giant boom works from from, but I'm pretty sure it's from the enemy camp. Uh, and then the guardian stuff's obviously from the guardian stuff, and then the blood sword we just got, and then the fart spear, which is already pretty cool in itself. So I'm very glad that we took the D2 that we did. Anyways. Yeah! <laughs> That's great, dude. This is the guy that killed me, too, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, this is a guy that could. Okay. I need to uh, watch out. What? Oh, what? What the heck? How did that do so much damage? Who is this guy? Who is this guy? Um. Alright, so. Oh, actually, I should probably eat a little more. Uh, yeah, dubious. There we go. Dubious food, right when you need it. Ah, ba 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 ba. Don't get hit by that. There we go. That's a dead guy. And a giant sword, which I'm gladly going to be taking right here. Knight's claim. 40 38. That's our second strongest right now, right? Behind. The yeah. Oh my gosh, dude. We are getting all the good weapons today, dude. This is nuts. Oh my goodness, guys. Wow. Final episode of Subscriber Week for you guys. Final episode right here. Well, it seems that we have made it, everyone. <laughs> Excuse me. It seems that we have made it to the Zor's Domain, everyone. So, I'm going to finally say, everyone, thank you for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe if you have enjoyed the video. Comment if you have anything to say. Share with friends. Everyone, I'll see you next time on The Legend of Zelda. Bless. Of the wild and everyone I'll see you then bye that was great dude yo <laughs> see those weapons ah that's some good weapons wow oh I I I I I um right everyone seeing you then bye